Hello everybody, I'm Shadow Slayer X, and uh, prepare your butts, prepare your alien hinds, we're going to be playing some XCOM 2. Now I've been meaning to put XCOM 1 up um, for probably like a year or two, but uh, I had XCOM on the Xbox 360 I think before I even decided to start recording. Uh, so. I was, was trying to think, like, do I get a capture card, or um, how to work that. But I kind of didn't feel so bad when I heard that XCOM 2 storyline kind of negates everything you accomplished in XCOM 1. And what I mean by that, well, you'll see in the opening cinematic they try to explain where the world is right now. If you played through XCOM and XCOM Enemy Within, a great game, like if it ever goes on sale, pick up Enemy Within. It should include all the DLC for Enemy or X Enemy Unknown. Um, amazing game. So uh, let's. So I'll just quickly, briefly uh, go over what happened. So in XCOM, in XCOM One, if you were successful, um, you just des you destroy the alien base, basically, and you liberate Earth. But in XCOM 2, that doesn't happen, so... What I'm gonna do is, we're gonna do the tutorial in this episode, um, but I'm gonna start over in episode 2 without the tutorial. Because um, in XCOM 1, I believe if you did the tutorial, your base uh, wouldn't be built the same way, and like, I think you... And the tutorial forces you to lose soldiers, um, and I think you can re you can do your first mission however the hell you want without the tutorial. In XCOM 1, um, maybe I'll do this video and then research to see if that's the case, but if you see that happening in Episode 2, that's why. So, uh, rookie, appropriate for players new to tactical games or XCOM in general, that's not me. Challenge appropriate for players familiar with XCOM, that's totally me. A significant challenge for experienced XCOM 2 players only, so, nah. Can't enable tutorial on Legend difficulty. A longer game with no margin for error. Only the strongest XCOM players will survive. The tutorial will not be enabled for Legend difficulty. See, see, there you go. See, why? Why is the tutorial not, huh? Huh? Anyway. So, uh, this option will reduce voiceover directed towards new players. No, we're fine for now. Show subtitles, yep. Tutorial, yep. Alright, let's get this started. I'm so excited. Excitement continues to build as city centers across the globe prepare for the 20th anniversary of so Unification these are Day. Thousands line up at the site of the Great Accord, celebrating the formation of the Advent Coalition. Keeping with their promise to humanity, 12 new gene therapy See, clinics the will have be taken opening over. in select cities by the I end of the new year. Despite the attempted attack by fringe elements, operations at the new facility in Paris thankfully yeah. remain unaffected. In response to the unprovoked on the eve of our most beloved celebration, the speaker reaches out to us. He looks like a thin man with more hair from a small number come. of dissidents again repeat the mistakes of the old world. Striking as we celebrate the relevant savior of time and again offers only friendship and compassion. No. Yet these trivial actions could never break the bond between humanity and the elders. Mm -hmm. Keeping forces have already made several preemptive arrests of known collaborators. Advent again assures all citizens that today's celebrations will continue as planned. Perfect. Ooh. Someone's a badass. The Advent administration reminds you to report all suspicious activity to your Scanning checkpoints, scary. Approaching position. You were right. They've definitely got their hands full today. Stay focused. Prep gate crasher. 
60 seconds. Nice. There were no... Oof. There were no cutscenes like this, I don't remember, in the first one. Ooh. Is that all you got? They look human. They sound alien. No. Signal received. Loud and clear. Nice. Blue okay, is the color of XCOM. Your turn. Sky Ranger? Or the new, new Sky Ranger, I should say. Ever since the XCOM from 1991 or whatever, you would, your first ship was always a Sky Ranger. And then XCOM Enemy Unknown, it was also a Sky Ranger, so. I wouldn't be surprised if they changed the name of this. It is XCOM 2. Advent forces are swarming to the blast point. We need to move on the package before they figure out what we're up to. Awesome. First things first. You need to get out of sight. Grab some cover near that low wall. Copy that. Moving up. Okay. So this looks exactly the same as XCOM. Can I WASD to move? Yes. It's a little fast, but I can change that. Alright. Right click to move here. Simple. Peter Osai. Unit flag. The unit flag shows the selected soldiers health and actions remaining. Soldiers get two actions per turn. Osei now has one action remaining. In position, but I'm exposed here. It's better than nothing, but see if you can't find a safer position further out. Looks like full cover ahead. Moving out. Yeah, so the shields, obviously, uh, a half shield's half cover. Full shield is full cover. Uh, this position provides high cover. Units in cover gain a defense bonus. Low cover provides moderate defense. High cover provides excellent defense. Always try to end your moving cover. It's very true. The only time I think I don't do that is when I'm uh, rushing a sniper. Two. Stay close. Keep These pace both look... One. They do have different weapons, so I'm assuming... Do they have different weapons? Are they just holding them differently? So this is a dash. So within the blue line is your first action, and then up to where you can go for the second one. Soldier can cover long distance by dashing this. Yeah, that's what I just explained. Except better. Assault rifle. Maybe they both have assault rifles. Maybe they're unclassed in the position. tutorial. We're gonna have to go through them. Stay out of sight till we're ready to strike. Copy that. In the tutorial for XCOM, you had four soldiers, and you like lose. Do you lose one or three? I can't forget. Ooh, concealed. Now this is new. This wasn't in XCOM Enemy Unknown or Within. Most missions start with a squad and concealment. Use concealment to set up ambushes. If any of your soldiers are spotted, all of your soldiers lose the benefits of concealment. Cool. Enemies are not aware of your soldiers while you are concealed. Use concealment to advance and set up ambushes. Will do. Stay in low. Water is awesome. Don't get too close. They'll be spotted for sure and we'll lose oh, our Oh, is advantage. Avenger the name of the Sky Ranger? That's a good name. Okay, hold on. Do to do. Do do to do. Da da da. Do do to do 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 do. See how that works. Yeah, it's much better. It's a lot easier. See, my problem is this doesn't look very stealthy if they were just looking they out the corner the of their numbers, eye, but, but roleplay-wise, I assume the person's going to be as um, stealthy as they can be. Oh, snap. It's their captain. For those who have played um, XCOM and the Unknown slash Within, um, if I ever say Unknown, I also mean Within. If I say Within, I also mean Unknown. Uh, press 
Enter or left click on an action button to activate the tactical combat UI. Click fire weapon or press enter to confirm the attack. Yeah, and then I think you can tab to cycle through. So they all have percentages of how much I can kill them. So I'm probably going to go for the one that has 68. Now this is new here at the bottom left. I really like it. It tells you what, what your percentage is coming from. So his aim is worth 65% uh, and then uh, the weapon also gives him a little small bonus. He's got 68 chance to hit, dealing 3 to 5 damage with 40% crit. Um, and the crit is because I'm flanking them, aka I'm stealth, I think, and they're not in cover. Right? So if I hit enter... So we totally kill that dude. The game's gonna lose it for a second. We're revealed. Now these guys, uh, lo losing concealment. The entire squad loses concealment when any soldier attacks an en enemy, breaking windows or kicking open doors. A soldier is flanked or steps on a detection tile. All right. So what I was they saying is, you now. how about you all shoot first and celebrate later? No problem. We'll do. Okay, so before we move Anna Ramirez, um, I just wanted to point out, these guys have three health, and they seem to be the basic unit, uh, basic enemy we'll be fighting. So these guys are like the small little aliens, aka the sectoids, um, from the, the first game. Now we right saw a sectoid in the main screen, the uh, main menu, and they looked a lot beefier than they did in the first game, I'll tell you that. So they're probably going to be like... Um, referencing to the old one outsiders or like uh, commanders kind of thing enter the tactical combat ui click on the highlighted head icon or press tab to cycle between enemy targets well we only have a good shot on one we're losing due to low cover what's this do oh, i want that up what are you talking about good job ramirez Missed. Not going out that uh oh, this doesn't look good for Ramirez. Oh, ho, ho, ho. well, she's gone. Damn it. You can't take risks like that. Watch your flanks. So that's how you want to play it. Okay. Grenade time. What? Why? Trust you, tutorial. Maneuver to flank enemy units so you can hit them from vulnerable angles. Cover does not protect a unit from the side. Oh yeah. Nice work. Press the advantage before they get around you. Get wrecked for an 82%. Attacking a flanked unit ignores its defensive bonus, and there is a high chance to score a critical hit. Do not let enemies flank you. This is full Ramirez! Love it. Advent. Uh oh. What are you doing? Not really. Owned. It's the old man, probably. Right? Am I right? It's Ramirez? Please be Ramirez. Stop that. Oh no, it's the, it's the old man. Transmission. Central, reporting in. You're late. What have you been doing down there? Taking oh, they are aliens. What the hell are these things? They're us. At least they used to be. <gasps> Human hybrid soldiers. Advent's reward for obedience and service. I would We've not all heard rumors. Be a hybrid man. I just never there are people who would be. True. They're, they're no out there. wanted to. But we find what we're looking for today. I promise you that's going to change. Let's move. Now, I'm wondering this like old man, in quotes, reminds me of a character from XCOM 1, but he wasn't as grizzled and. 
He was definitely not like so war torn. I don't know. Keep your eyes peeled. Fire on anything that moves. Soldiers in Overwatch will shoot the first enemy. Oh, I love Overwatch. Uh, first enemy unit they see moving. Activate Overwatch now to prepare for, re for the reinforcements. Overwatch. Yeah, so when you're in Overwatch, is clear. We need to move it's so good. Package. Like, it's if you have a bunch of people in Overwatch, I don't like that. Central. What am I doing? Menace three. You should check that body for salvageable gear. We need anything we can get at this point. Better move fast though. I've heard rumors Advent rigs their stuff to self-destruct. This weapon upgrade will Oh this is this was new too. There was no loot recovery. So rookie Jane Kelly has found a scope. Cool. They've rigged their bodies to explode. It's kinda crazy. ships. Yeah, I've noticed they have this like red laser technology that they've used in multiple different places. Like um, it's it works as like their barriers. Reinforcements just hit the But ground. we've seen people walk like right They're through it. Nervous. Now I know we're in the right place. Oh, I want to kill the commander dude so bad. Get him. Yeah, Peter. I want to rename him to Batman. Well Fall back to our position. I might not get a Peter Osai if I don't do the tutorial. I'll keep this as a separate save file just in case there's no change. Because it's actually a kind of neat story like to lose somebody. The only reason I wouldn't do it is if, if it puts you at a, a tactical worse advantage. Okay, so we have a choice to hit Advent Trooper. Or Advent Officer. So I say we kill the trooper. Um, having two people fire at you is bad. Like, because if we shoot the other one, we can't kill him. Wait, what? Why can't I shoot? Oh. That was weird. Wait, what? Do I not have enough ammo? How do we get out of this? Return to movement? What am I supposed to do? Fire a weapon? Do I have to shoot this guy? I do. Oh man. Thanks, tutorial. So P you're leaving Peter to die. Clearly you don't care about Peter. I care about Peter. You should be able to cut right through the door's security protocols. They were never expecting anyone to get this close. Okay. All soldiers can hack certain computers, lock doors, and some other objects to gain access and temporary bonuses. Okay, how do I do that? Oh. Hack. Pull up my iPad. Okay. Well. So, there's no negative effect. Choose a hack reward. So, no matter what, we're going to unlock the door 100%. Soldier immediately gains concealment. Soldier gains complete immunity from the next two attacks. Jeez. Obviously, we have to go 2% chance. Like, come on. Let's be a little, uh... Let's not push it. Hooray! We're in. Good. Let's go. Get in there, Central. Start a cutscene. Moving to secure the package. Let's hope our intel was good. 
This is the place. Are you sure? That could be anything. Goku. Soldiers can carry unconscious dead and bleeding out units. This soldiers. Okay. Carry unit. Oh, he's invisible. The entire advent security grid just lit up. Firebrand is holding nearby for evac. Firebrand. Now or never, Central. Understood. We're on the move. Okay, this is where we lose Peter. Oh damn. No, Peter. No. Oh, he got killed here. And then shot over here like three more times. No, Central. Pressure one is down. You have to get out of there. We need another exit now. Goddamn tutorials. Got it covered. Oh yeah. Throw grenade here. Grenades are not as lethal as firearms, but can damage multiple units and destroy cover walls. How are they not as powerful? Let's just let, let's just be honest, guys. Whoops. Fire in the hole. Aren't they more? Like with a gun. What? At most, you could kill two people. Work with one me. bullet. With one grenade, you could kill a lot of people. Like, if there's a crowded room... Okay. We're, horrible scenario. There's a crap ton of people in a uh, elevator. And you shoot a, a bullet into this crowded elevator. Max, you'll kill, what, two, three people? Throw a grenade in the elevator. You kill all of them. Well, okay, maybe you won't kill all of them, but you will kill a bunch and injure a lot more. Whatever. Soldiers cannot attack while carrying in the unit, but can still kick, take cover and move at full speed. Gotcha. Oh. Ha! <laughs> I couldn't see that. I didn't know you wanted me to move here. Almost there. Stay focused. That's cool though. I wonder if you'll have to recover, like, shock an alien, like a live alien, and then bring them back to your ship. Oh, if I lose her, man. Holy sh... He's got, like, rainbow bullets? Or is it because of one Wait shot? Oh, you're done. You're done for, miss. Ugh. Burns. Let me guess, he's gonna escape and she's gonna get captured. We need an immediate evac. Get us out of here. That was quick. Select call Sky Ranger icon, booyah, or press P to place an evac zone. Select target area and confirm placement. With. That's really cool. Press P. How many turns does it take for a Sky Ranger to come? Keep moving. You don't need to tell me twice. What's happening? We're coming home. A unit standing within the evac zone can activate the evac ability to safely extract from combat. And it's gonna leave her behind. Calling it. Calling it. Oh, she made it. She seemed to shot. Oh, she made it! Well, we lost Ramirez and uh, Osai. Oh, was there actually an arching bad guy? Like, like. What the hell?
Well, that's new. Who did we save? Who could it be? In the first one, we had Dr. Shen, who was the... No, Dr. Shen was the engineer. And... Carefully! There's potentially decades of atrophy to contend with. Wish we had more time. I don't disagree. But as it stands now, we risk losing the patient if we don't begin the removal procedure immediately. We are ready. Good. Then let's get on with it. I'm so excited. Remarkable. Just like 20 years ago. <gasps> We're still calling it a war back then. Cerebral cortex. Good. Prepping for cranial intrusion. Oh, thin men. I hate thin men. I've managed to identify the connection. Preparing to make final incision. These readings are getting really erratic. Of course they are. These implants were never designed to be removed. We are risking severe. No plan B here, people. Do it. Do it. Doctor. What's happening? Oh my god. No signal. Ooh. Are they the Capillary response normal. Vital stabilizing. Procedure complete. Told him it would take more than that to keep you down. Welcome back, Commander. Oh shit! So we're the same dude, the unseen dude from the first one. Glad to see you're finally coming out of it. Don't envy the headache you must have, though. Still, can't fault Dr. Tigan. Especially as no one's even attempted something like this before. Easy. We're still not entirely sure what they did to you. That chip was buried halfway into your skull. Lost a lot of good soldiers looking for you over the years. Almost gave up hope you were still out there. Acted on the intel as soon as I got word. Not sure what you remember, but... Uh... A lot's changed. Did the best I could, but the last 20 years have been tough without you. You feel like catching up. Shen has the archive up and running on your terminal. Otherwise, I'd go see Dr. Tigan when you're ready. There's some things you should know. He'll be better at explaining them than me. I got the feels. It's damn good to have you back, Commander. Got the feels. Woo! I love XCOM. I've played a crap ton of XCOM and XCOM. Uh, uh, Commander to the research labs. Spinoffs. Like I've played UFO extraterrestrials. I've played XCOM, the original Terror from the Deep. I tried playing three, four, and five. They were eh. And then. Um, my friends got there was like the original XCOM multiplayer where you could play as aliens versus aliens or uh, it was it was just fun anyway that was the tutorial um, some amazing cutscenes so I'll try my darnest to be back at this exact screen um, when we when I come back to this uh, it might not be for a while because I got some other uh, stuff I want to record as well but I am definitely playing through XCOM too. I'm not the best strategist, um, but, you know, like, losing has made me play multiple playthroughs, and you do get better, so, XCOM 2, man, I hope it, it improved upon all the things I liked about the original XCOM. It's got great reviews. You didn't even need to have a Commander great review to sell to me. Armory. Shut up. Talking. Anyway. Um, so... 
hopefully uh, everyone else is excited for this. I know I am. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Uh, tips would be appreciated, like tips on how to play. But you can also donate if you're feeling generous. I've been Shadows of Slayer X, signing out. Commander.